This is Cameron Chai from azonano.com bringing you another episode of Azo Nano TV and today I'm speaking to Stanislav Leesman from NTMDT and he's going to tell us about their new Integra life system. Hello, uh, I want to tell you about our new system, it's Integra Life, it's a scanning probe microscope or atomic force microscope uh, which is dedicated for biological research. So here you can see uh, this EFM stands on the inverted optical microscope which can be different type and uh, uh, at the same time you use a scanning probe and uh, uh, from the top you have uh, you have condenser up to 0.55 uh, numerical aperture and uh, from the bottom you can use uh, different kinds of uh, standard uh, um, objectives uh, up to immersed one up, up to 100 so here you can see this uh, this system is highly automated here you don't see any knobs because uh, all, 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 all the uh, all the mechanisms inside, inside are uh, motorized, uh, laser adjustment, uh, photodiode adjustment, uh, sample positioning, uh, uh, head positioning, uh, everything is motorized. So, uh, so one should not uh, have uh, big skills uh, in AFM uh, because uh, all, uh, all motors uh, uh, are running according intellectual algorithms. So here you see, this is example how, how the head can be lifted. And uh, on, on, on the screen or on the... Yes. Here we see erythrocytes, the optical image of erythrocytes. Uh, and uh, here, here you see EFM image of the same erythrocytes, and this can be uh, acquired out, uh, simultaneously. So, in uh, uh, during the single experiment, uh, EFM can be run uh, standardly uh, in liquid or in uh, air conditions without changing the tip. So we have uh, we have developed a unique system uh, for for optical tracking inside the inside the CFM head. Well, this is briefly everything what I wanted to tell. And this is a very new system, just recently released. Yes, uh, we we re uh, released this uh, uh, this year, I think. Like first installations were the started uh, this year. And what what sort of samples do people look at under this microscope? Uh, well, for, uh, from my, uh, my, my, my experience, uh, usually uh, pe people who, who deal with uh, di different kind of cells, bacteries, uh, or down to, uh, down to bio biological uh, molecules. So, um, actually this is a universal tool for uh, nanobiology. And what sort of resolution does it have? Oh, like uh, AFM resolution is uh, like uh, standard AFM resolution, uh, so down, down to atomic. Uh, and uh, in, in optics you can use uh, high uh, um, immersed objectives, so optical resolution is also up to highest uh, in the system. Okay, Stanislav, thanks very much for telling us about the new Integral Life System. You're welcome. <laughs>